Yay! Oh, here we go. I have scissors in here. Yay! And this is Templeton. He is going to help me with this unboxing video today. He's my little human little rat friend. And he's a cutie. He's uh, kind of the star of another unboxing video that I have not actually posted yet. <laughs> Are you eating your crunchy? I just gave him a crunchy, so he's like really excited. And I'm really excited because I am going to unbox this Singer Model 441 Heavy Duty Machine. And I am 39 years old and I have not had a new sewing machine since I was 18. So it's been 21 years. <laughs> and that last machine I think lasted me maybe 10 years um, and I had it serviced a couple times and it was a very good, it was a white uh, German made machine and it lasted a long time but eventually I broke it because um, I break everything which is why I bought myself a heavy duty one. I got this one from Amazon so if you're watching this review you might be, or not review but unboxing, you might be watching it on, on Amazon. Hi Evie! <laughs> I have cat friends too. Lots of cat friends! Lots of cat friends! And this is Evelyn. She is a foster fail ah, from when mommy lived in Texas. She's from Austin, Texas. And we are currently in Pennsylvania. And my little rat friend, I think you were in somebody's belly ah, when you came from Chicago. <laughs> so, yeah. You, you, you watch enough of my videos and you will meet all of the critters, all of the critter clan. You want another crunchy? He's like, yes, please. Crunchies, crunchies all day. You want another one? Another one? I should get right to the boxing, the unboxing though, because uh, that's the exciting part and that is why you're here. Um, and I think I covered what I wanted to to introduce the video. So it's, I'm just super excited because I haven't had a new machine. I hand sew everything. And during the pandemic, I kind of like, I bought myself two cheapy machines and they were good. I made, um, I made a lot of masks like this and, uh, they definitely worked for that. But then of course I burnt them out and broke them like everything. So this time around, um, not just for making masks, of course, since we're kind of, that's been rectified. We don't have to like crank them out at home anymore. And uh, hopefully um, we'll be headed away from everybody wearing masks all the time. It seems like we already are. So yay. Um, even though they did become a fun fashion item and definitely saved a lot of lives. Um, that's, that's all I got to say about that. <laughs> this machine is going to make a whole bunch of other stuff and I'm super excited about it. And let's start cutting tape and looking at things. Um, we have what's inside the box and they have all sorts of stuff that's like basic bobbin things and sewing machine feet. And it looks like a little packet of needles and a duster, seam ripper thing. So that all looks like it's really great. It's interesting to me um, because if you go for this model on the Singer website, which I tried twice and my order was canceled twice because I guess the minute they went on sale uh, for as refurbs for $150, they were just snatched up. And so I was pretty bummed out, but I got this one for um, $189. And since I'm a smart adult, I was able to use my Capital One cashback rewards, which you can link up to your Amazon account. Woo! <laughs> Money magic. So like I had like a $90 discount on it, so that was pretty awesome. Um, this promises powerful performance and sewing made easy. It's kind of a simple model, but that's all I really want. I just want a workhorse machine that is gonna power through me sewing through like canvas and denim. And um, I, I am a workhorse and I break everything. <laughs> um, not because I don't maintain it well or anything like that. I just use the crap out of all of my equipment. Uh, my vehicles, my shoes, um, 
my fire props, which I actually hand make most of those because they're just more durable if I make it myself. Anyway, so we have the tape cut. I've talked so, so much. Right on top is our, ooh, and it's pretty. Uh, instruction something something did you drop your crunchy oh and they have online they have like an online video which i might watch i was joking to myself because i was like i don't want to watch instructional videos but i've actually watched a lot of instructional videos um youtube youtube learning it is wonderful youtube academy <gasps> i can see it oh my gosh Okay, I have to stand up for this. Templeton, you are being a great assistant. I'm going to open the bag a little bit so that I can pull it up by the handle. I should definitely insert like some dramatic music here. Like a drum roll. There's got to be like a drum roll. Ah, fail. <laughs> fail. It's just packed like really smugly, which is good. That's wonderful. Um, oh, and now I have a rat on my head. Rat on my head. I have a rat on my head. Ooh, okay. So in the bottom of the box, and now I have a fun box, so that's great. The cats, the cats will love that. Is that over there? <laughs> it's a sturdy box. So it looks like they give you a nice dust cover which is cool. I will probably use this as a pattern to make a more durable dust cover, but that's very, that's very nice. <laughs> All over me, aren't you, little bum? Oh, and there's a cat in the box. I'm going to get a cell phone clip real quick. Definitely cat. And here's a little close-up of temples, temple tabs, and my boxes of projects behind me. Uh. <laughs> All right, back to. I give you a crunchy, crunchy yay! Okay, we'll look at the machine first, and then we'll look at what's in the baggie. So the machine part. People just were like using plastic covers for a long time and then they just decided to make a nice dust cover. No, no. And I have a little garbage can hidden behind there. So tucked nicely under here, get you a close up. Look at how nicely all of that is just like tucked in there and packaged. It's just very, very nicely done. In my opinion, uh, raise the presser foot. Looks like it's. It looks like it's all ready to go, which makes me really excited. I don't see a bottle of machine oil in here, but that's okay. I have a bottle of machine oil somewhere in my stuff <laughs> that's lasted me like a hundred thousand years. So, a little piece of paper. Um, another. A steam craft iron, it's a coupon. I have one actually. So, this is the 4400 series. This is a knowing your sewing machine. Um, I'm looking at it here. <laughs> you can look at it, knowing your sewing machine. It's just a nice little pamphlet here with a bunch of stuff on it. So, set up and threading. So, you know. If you want to watch a video, I guess you could watch a video. If you want to read stuff, you can read stuff. Um, but they are definitely, oh my gosh. It's so shiny. It's so shiny. <laughs> oh, I love it. I love it. And I like that it's gray. It's different tones of grays. Um, and you can see, like, there's, there's stuff written on it. 
it's almost like they made it for me. <laughs> because I'm like, oh look, directions on the machine. This should be very easy for me to use. I'm going to play with the dial a little bit. Ooh, it works. It's like turning nice. and that's a spool holder to line the bobbin. Gretto. Gretto, hi buddy. <laughs> hi. Templeton has been with me since October. He's an adopted rat. He is an only rat, but um, I play with him a lot and spoil the crap out of him and he seems very happy. Um, I can't get in over my head with critters, and he needed a home, so. Huh. Sometimes we just get an only child. We get an only child. Okay. Rat love pause. Installation instructions. Oh, here's another kitty. Hi, Tuna. Little tiny Tuna. Um... Installation. I think it's cute that they call it installation. Um, yeah, it's plugging in your machine directions and plugging in the foot pedal, which is nice, big, chunky, durable. Like I love, I need, I love and need heavy duty things. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Um, that is just how I am. If it looks like I can't break it right away, I get really stoked because I just break stuff. Um, yeah, anyway. You can see there is Big Eye Tuna has just gone over to plink on her piano because <laughs> that is what she does. Ha! Huh. You need a plink, a plink, a plink, huh? And we're going to bring it down. Bring it on down. There's the machine. And. Yeah, fun to just dump things out. So we're just gonna dump things out. Um, I don't know what a bunch of this stuff is, but I know that it was supposed to come with the machine. So this is very handy. I do know what this is. This is for cleaning out in the machine. Um, don't know what this is, I'll find out. Extra presser foot, other thing, maybe that's a that might be a buttonhole attachment. I don't know. Um, <laughs> this is for holding on your spool of thread whenever you're winding bobbins. And that, this stuff is probably also something to do with that. And they give you some plastic starter bo bobbins, which is great. Um, I have a bunch of metal ones, but I think I also have a bunch of plastic ones. Oh, this is probably for buttonholes. Hmm. Yeah, that's what's in the bag. And that's the machine. I'm just going to finish this off. Ah, there he is. <laughs> with a little cell phone footage um because that's easier for me and say thanks for watching and um if you like this video hit uh hit like hit subscribe leave me a little feedback if there's stuff that you would like to see in other unboxings i don't do them a lot but whenever um, i make a major purchase that i'm really excited about i like to share that excitement because it's fun and um you know at some point soon i'll write a review and uh, probably post post that too. Maybe do a couple video demos of making things with the singer. So yay, definitely subscribe if you're interested in that content or if you wanna see some of the fun stuff I make. I do costuming um, and I do a lot of sewing and I have an Etsy store. So, oh, and I wanted to introduce Egg on a Ledge. <laughs> he is, this is a cute little stuffedy. I did not make him. He is a custom stuffed animal. Um, I will pop a link to where you can get yours. They're $25 and the proceeds go towards Neonate Rescue, um, the Chris Griffey Memorial Foundation that my friend Ellen um, founded and uh, is a major a part of <laughs> and she helped me learn how to do neonate rescue for kittens like Evelyn that you met earlier in the video um, and so you know essentially without Ellen's involvement in in my life I might not have known how to do some of the important work 
that I've been able to do for, for, for little kittens. And she does amazing work too. Um, but that's egg on a ledge. <laughs> he's $25. He's super cute and, uh, makes a great gift. And he will be appearing in a lot of my videos because I love him. And I love talking about, uh, the work that, that, uh, Ellen does. So yay. Thanks a lot for watching. And, uh, yeah, leave me some love. Say hi. I'd love to get to know some people that are tuning in. So until next time.